I want to uh, show you the hostas I have outside my front door, which I see every day when I come in and out. I'm in Cooper in Scotland, and I'm going to walk up to the first one I want to focus on, which is Liberty. Beautiful yellow, gold and green. Really, really lovely. Showing itself really well, and it goes on for ages. This one is one of my favourites, which is why it gets to be in the whiskey cask. Being in Scotland, that's very appropriate. Next to it, we've got a Loyalist. Let's just come in a bit closer on that. Gorgeous twisted leaves. Here, next to it, we've got four, count them, four Francie. Now, these ones, um, I deliberately dug it out of the ground to put it in a pot. Uh, and when I did that, it basically fell into four pieces. So that's why I've now got four of them. Next to that, two Patriots. One of the themes of this area is the American uh, War of Independence or American Revolution, uh, because a lot of these descend from Francy. So Patriot comes from Francy and Loyalist comes from Patriot. Next to that, a Fire and Ice, which is another one that is a reversed variant of uh, Patriot. Again, lovely twisted leaves, green, various colours. Behind that, uh, Fortunae Aurea Marginata. That one, a couple of uh, slug holes. That one is very cheap from Morrison's, the supermarket last year. Then we come on to an interesting one. These ones definitely hit the theme because they're called Revolution. Uh, those two are separated ones. But interestingly, this guy here is also a revolution from the same plant. But what happened was some genetic change took it back to the original form. It's actually really quite a nice pure green form. And there's one in between. So these four revolutions all came from one plant originally in my garden and then various bits turned into different types. So I've uh, divided them. The one that is most like the original is this one. And what you can see there are some specks on the middle of it. So while we're on that, let's come over here and look at this one. And this is called Independence, yet another one from the theme. And this is interesting because this is a reversed variant of the Independence. And this time, when I say reversed, you can see that it's got its specks in the margins, not in the middle. And this one is really really nice grows well i got this from the local garden center and it was said on it grown in the new forest and i wish i knew who grew it because they're very good at growing hostas this one was also sold as revolution i'm not so sure about that because i don't see any green flecks in the middle so it may have slightly gone back to its loyalist roots and if we go through a chain we would start with francie that turned into Patriot, Patriot turned into Loyalist, Loyalist turned into Revolution, and Revolution turned into Independence. And I've saved the best till last. I don't know what this one is, except that I know it is my favorite of all, uh, and that's why it gets the biggest whiskey cask pot. There's just something about this one I got it at a garden centre a few years ago. I don't remember what it was sold as. And this is where my interest in this kind of family comes from. The twisted leaves, the um, fantastically gorgeous uh, white centres, dark greens outside and an in-between green in the middle. And it's just something about this one that, that gets me. And that's why I've got into all of these variety of variants. Everything down here except the Liberty at the top is a variant of, of one of these. So thank you.